Hello babes, welcome back to my channel. Today we are back with another Shein haul. This Shein haul is going to be a little bit different. I have a whole basket full of things. So there's like a little bit more accessories. I do still have some clothes that I'm going to show you guys that are super cute. Um, I think the next Shein haul is going to be like full on summer. It's either going to be like maybe just do a swimsuit one for you. So if you guys want to see one, let me know down below. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button and also click that bell so you guys get notified for all of my brand new videos. And follow me on IG. It is at Steph and Shimaseto. I also wanted to do a little shopping spree giveaway for you guys. So make sure you keep on watching and I will mention somewhere in this video how to enter. I'm gonna have two coupon codes. So one for my US babes. And I also have a Canadian code. So for all my Canadian babes, you do have to be shopping on the Canadian flag, on the Canadian side, on the international website. And then for my US babes, make sure you guys are on their regular US website and you guys can use my code. And they're already super affordable, you guys. If you're wondering where this shirt is from, I made it. Um, it's from Steph's tie-dye shop. No, I don't have a tie-dye shop. You guys are gonna die, but my like my joints are hurting from like squeezing out. I've been like washing these shirts by hand instead of in my washing machine. But yes, I did make this shirt myself, so this is not from them. Um, I believe they have this exact necklace on their website, and if they do, I will link it. But I also got a few other ones from them that I'm gonna go through with you guys too. Everything that I have in today's video will be linked down below. So if you check my description box, everything will be listed for you guys. If anything requires sizing, I will also leave my sizing right beside the item. I got these scrunchies, which I'm now obsessed with, to be honest. Um, I never was a scrunchie person, and I feel like with certain trends, it takes a while to kind of grow on me. I really love them, you guys. I decided to try them. This little tie over here, you can remove it. and try to show you guys. So if you guys were to do like a little bun, it could also show at the top. I'm not really into that. I'm very minimal, as you guys know. But I've been wearing these at home non Stop. I've been wearing these two mainly. They have a ton of different scrunchies on their website, so make sure you guys check them out. Obviously, I love this color because I wear a ton of these neutral tones, but I like to do a really nice, like, top bun. Normally, when I tie up my hair with the normal hair ties, it kind of hurts when I have the top bun because I have a lot of hair, you guys. These, they're just so super comfortable, so now I consider myself a scrunchie girl. I got this necklace that I've already worn. That's why it's open. I wore this in my um, boohoo haul. So it is a rose necklace. It looks really super cute. It's really great for layering too. Like I said, I think they have this necklace as well. They have so many to choose from. These sell out like crazy. There was a few that I chose and I wasn't able to get them. But make sure if you guys like them, grab them. They're so affordable. They're like $6, $7. I got this little mini jewelry box. This comes, I believe, in two different colors. I got the cream-ish one. It has a very slight like pearlescent kind of look to it but it's in a very smooth, like satiny feeling of vinyl. And then on the inside, this is what it looks like, you guys. So it has little compartments. This little like thing is like an insert, so you can remove it if you don't want all these, but I did need a place. Right now I only have a little carrier that's good for my rings, but I need something that's for these necklaces. So I was thinking of putting the necklaces inside of here. There's also a little space to put it over here some room for um, some earrings and then more room for rings. So I might just like put my bands over here like just to kind of split them up. This is like my palette. I like black, I like white, creams, um, neutral tones sands and taupes so this definitely fit in with my style so they also have a ton of accessories like this that you guys can pick up to also travel with like i could easily pack my jewelry or anything anything that's really super small you could just put this inside of your luggage or your carry-on bag and you can take it with you so this is really great so i decided to get a few nail accessories because i'm like let me see if Shein has some nail stuff as you guys know, I've been doing my nails at home. I have to, um, I want to change the color. I don't have to redo them, but I just want to change up the color just to make it nice and fresh. I'm like obsessed with nails and anything nails right now. Something I want to definitely try is poly gel. And I was like, you know what? This is a really good affordable place to not spend too much money and get what I kind of need. So it comes with the set where you get the nail forms in obviously different sizes, but really super excited i'm gonna try this i don't know when i still have to get the actual poly gel color that i want to use but at least i have the nail forms and i really like how these are because they're not too curved and it also came with a nail file too which i can never have 
that many nail files because I love shaping my nails. It's like my favorite thing. I actually need to freshen up this shape because when the corners get rounded, oh, it's just so cringy to me. And then it also comes with your poly gel tool that you need to put on the poly gel into the forms and the brush on the other end. So this was kind of like a three piece set where it came with all these three things. But if you guys are looking for nail accessories, they have a ton of nail accessories on their website. So this is something that I'm gonna keep for when I wanna try out the poly gel and it's three less things I need to buy when I try it. Okay, this is a, um, how many necklaces are in here? Let me untangle this first. By the way, you guys, I'm having like really, really bad chapped lips. So if my lips look like they have little scaly dry pieces on them, well, you're seeing right, sweetheart. You're not blind. I'm trying to deal with it. I'm told not to pick at it, so I'm not going to pick at it. I'm just going to look ugly. Funny enough, I was looking at it and I'm like, oh my God, no wonder why I thought that. So this necklace is actually a part of the layer. So it's this pendant right over here. So this one comes with one, two, three, four little pendants, but it's three necklaces in one, so they're not separate. They're all in one thing. This beautiful emerald pendant at the bottom, like, <gasps> they had some other ones, and like I said, they were sold out. So if you guys see one that you like, add it to your car and just get it because there were so many that I was not able to get my hands on. Okay, this thing over here I thought was really super cute. It also goes with my style because again, I'm very minimalistic. So this is a box that you guys can basically use for anything. I actually love that it can sit on top of your counter and it looks really hella like minimalistic. This thing basically swivels around and it comes with these little compartments and this is how it looks. So this is also really great for putting your jewelry. This is how it looks. So this is really great to kind of sit on your counter. It looks really simple and minimalistic and you can put a bunch of things in here. Or I can also put this inside of my drawer and maybe my rings can also go inside of here, my necklaces. This is also a really great kind of like jewelry box if you guys don't wanna have the actual box like this. But both of these can be used for the same thing. I don't know if you guys are like me, but I always have little tiny things all over the place and I never know where to put them. This next set is another nail set that I got. So this one is a bunch of buffers and nail files and I really wanted a cube buffer. So this one, I haven't even opened any of these yet because I didn't want to use them and then not be able to show you guys. So it also tells you what it's for. So remove ridges, file nail edge, shine nail, smooth nail. So there's also a cube. And then we have some other ones. So this is also considered, you can use it as a buffer. Um, this side is a lot more like rough. This is a 100 and 180 grit um, nail file. This is normally the grit that I like to use on my nails. Ooh, don't get me started on my nails, girl, because I could just sit here and just start filing for y'all, you know what I'm saying? I love filing my nails. Can we just pause this video so I can just like sit here and just shape my nails? Then we have another nail file. This just feels like a regular, like, kind of feels like a 100 grit, maybe something less. <coughs> I think I'm having some allergies. It's a beautiful time to be alive. Um, so, so that is another nail set. I got a bunch of different nail files. This over here, which I think is so cute. Like, I just wanted to try them. So these little hair clips. It comes with two different ones. So one is smaller, the other one is larger, but they're kind of like bedazzled. Can you guys see that? Oh my God, it's so cute. So you would just like put one on the side over here. Let me close it up so you guys can see. These or just for like a party or going out to dinner. And they have a bunch of those clips, you guys. So I can also leave a link for you. Did I put on deodorant today? Yeah, I did. Guys, I put on perfume today. I've been putting on perfume for like the last three days. Just makes me feel like a normal person, you know what I mean? These, you guys always ask me where I get my black ones from and I'm pretty sure they have these in black or other styles that's very similar to mine. I like a very square kind of oversized uh, sunglass, um, sunglasses, Sun, whatever. So I got these ones in turtoise. I love, I always say turtoise, but you guys say it's tortoise, like whatever. Like whatever, and no one has time for that. Watch yourself. Like they're so, so, so classic. So if you guys want ones that kind of look like my black ones, I will leave this link down below. I love the finish of them. The only downfall for me is that I need prescription in my sunglasses to see properly. Whereas y'all can wear as many different ones as you want. So that's the one disadvantage. But these are hella cute. 
I'm working on. I think with this set, you guys, I'm not 100% sure because there's just so much packaging in front of me that I think it came with this. This I really, really wanted. So this is a little mini brush for when you're doing your manicure and you have like a bunch of little pieces of dust or anything that you filed and you kind of want to just brush off your nails. So now I have something to dust off my nails with, you know what I'm saying? This set, which is another um, set with a bunch of nail files and... Um, buffers so it comes with that other one I showed you guys like this then it comes with a little mini one which is so super cute this is really cute if you're traveling then it came with another nail file or sorry another nail buffer so two of them came with a cuticle cutter and this too you guys are gonna die but I used to use this as like a nail file when I was younger I thought it was like a life Another nail file, it also came with two of these guys. This one has a really rough edge. So these are things that, to be honest, over time, they really wear out. So I'm glad that I have a few of them to use. It comes with the actual box too. So it's one less thing you have to think about, like how you're going to store it. I'm really excited for this. So this is what I'm going to be using when I apply new tips. You're going to die, but I put on these tips. I spent like six hours doing my nails. And then the next day, this is when this came. So this is a nail uh, tip cutter. So if you guys are putting on fake artificial nails, you guys just put in your nail like this and you can just cut it. I wasn't going to cut my nail. Watch yourself. Um, but yeah, it works really, really well. And I actually, I had opened up the package and like tried it on one just to make sure. It's really cute that it's pink. So now I have something to properly cut my artificial nails because I was using scissors to do so. so have you guys like created this new sleeping habit where like you go to bed at like 3, 4 a.m. in the morning? Cause like that's where I'm at. And I'm just like, who are you? Like I'm somebody that can only go to bed at like 10, 11. It's been like 12, 1, 2, 3. Like 12 is actually like, oh, it's 12 a.m. Starting to get late. Like it's insane. Let's move on to the shoes. Like I said, I love Shein's shoes. They have so many cute shoes. And again, they're so affordable. So this sandal so super cute it's kind of like a flip-flop but a little bit more a dressed up version of a flip-flop it's in a very like latte creamy beige kind of color i got all of these in my regular size they're in like a vinyl fabric and they're really kind of they're not super shiny they're like kind of a satin finish but that's the back of them if you guys want to see them and i just like how you can like get away with wearing these for dinner time you can get away with these bringing them on the beach can get away with them for lunch for an everyday outfit so love them my shoe collection i'm not even a shoe person like i'm not obsessed obsessed with shoes but my shoe closet it's like completely full so somebody's lying i'm not a shoe person i'm running out of room in my shoe closet said every woman so these guys i obviously fell in love with because number one they are my palette they're my color they look super minimalistic they look really high a designer too like look at these guys at the bottom over here it's more of a shiny material these guys are so comfortable it looks so good on my feet i'll show you guys of course what all these shoes look like on me it has this little mini kind of block square heel then i got these these are more of like a sand beige just so that you guys can compare so this is more of like a cool tone but again has this very like knit sort of fabric on the top at the back it just looks like that these are also very true to size these i love as you guys can tell my favorite sandals are the ones that you just slip on make sure you guys look through all the sandals and stuff before you guys check out because there's so many of them really comfortable really flexible too so they're not like hard when you're walking in them really nice and light too which is also important last but not least shoe one thing i will mention with this one with the sizing is i kind of wish i don't know if they do half sizes but you guys my foot like ever since i've lost weight my feet have shrunk i used to be like a seven and a half and now i'm like a true size six but when it has like something at the back over here i'm technically a true size like five and a half so if they don't have five and a half of these, I could have done a five. Like how small is my freaking foot? So I got these guys in a six and I just kind of wish at the back over here because it does have to hold your heel in place. They still hold my heel, but I just wish I was a little bit more snug in them. So I would say whatever your true foot size is, maybe go down a half a size. These sandals are so super cute. They're so strappy. Again, they're really minimalistic. Has this very like 
rich looking leather at the bottom um again it has the very square front edge i feel like that's like the new thing because it's supposed to look very high-end and designer this is the side profile of them all right guys here is how you enter the shopping giveaway i'm giving away with shein 150 dollars for you guys to shop on their website so make sure you guys enter by following all of these steps so I got this sports bra like how cute is this you guys it has this really cute baby bubblegum pink at the top and it kind of has like an ombre detail this is obviously a sports bra I got a size small it just has the racer back like this I think they had the leggings to match this but I kind of just like to go plain on the bottom a little bit more fun on the top I feel like it suits me best they have a bunch of workout outfits you guys they have a bunch of sports bras they have a bunch of leggings so make sure you guys check them out Cycle shorts, they have a lot of too, and just like short shorts if you guys want to check them out. But I love this. I thought it was so cute. I'm obviously going to wear it for you guys too, so you guys can see how it looks. It also has the hole for you to remove the padding, but it does come with padding. Generally, I do wear it with padding if it comes with it. This top I thought was really cute, a really cute kind of accent top, especially because it's getting so freaking hot over here now. Yesterday was 33 degrees Celsius. Oh, it's hot, girl. Girl. What is 33 degrees into Fahrenheit? So today it is 80 degrees, okay? I'm sweating, y'all. Like, I'm sitting here and sweating and I'm in a tea. My face is probably dewy as hell and it's what it is. I got this tank top, which I think is so super cute. It does like a little crisscross kind of moment at the chest area. Um, and it does come with padding on this part. You guys can probably tell. Something like this I wouldn't wear a bra, to be honest with you. Also comes with adjustable straps, which is very important for me because I have a very like weird proportion over here and they're always, the straps are usually too big unless they're, unless they're elastic. This is just a really super cute top. It's kind of a crop top if you're not wearing something um, super high-waisted, but I'm 90% in something high-waisted. 95, 98. 100% of the time fine kind of rib detail this feels like your typical like cottony sort of feel very stretchy you guys so it's very very comfortable oh this is one size it says okay so when I saw it I was like this looks really stretchy so maybe that's why so it is one size you guys I feel like this can fit up to like a C almost D chest with the D you probably will get like a lot of cleavage if you're cool with that this was such a cute graphic tee that I had to get it. So it says, future is in your hands, and it has like a really big sun on it. And then at the back, it's super plain. There's nothing on the back. An oversized tee, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I got this in a small. So it is an oversized tee, you guys, just to keep that in mind. Like, look how big this is compared to me. So it's definitely oversized. But I love oversized tees. Obviously, I'm living in them right now. The tie-dye video is coming, you guys. It's the next video I'm gonna film, so sorry for keeping you guys waiting on that. I think it's so super cute. Of course, I'm gonna wear it for you guys with a pair of jeans and with one of the sandals so I can show you guys how it looks. Really quick, like, summer look where you guys can put this on. Light pair of ripped jeans, which you guys already know, that's my favorite. And then a necklace, your sunglasses, you're good to go sweetheart you can do a top bun with your scrunchie so it's really kind of easy this can even be used like if you have like a black bikini and because it's oversized just put it over your bikini it's a really cute like beach kind of outfit with a pair of shorts i know we've been like at home and it seems crazy to even say this but i personally feel like i need a vacation after this when things are like safe safe like safe 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 i need to just yeah i feel like this has also taught me personally that life is too short you don't know when these things can happen and everything don't forget you guys will be left down below in the description box and don't forget to use the code for your country if you guys are in the u.s or my canadian babes i do have a code for you guys so make sure you check that out down below in the description box and hopefully you guys enjoyed this haul if you guys are also not following me on ig it is at steph g macedo and if you guys are not subscribed make sure you click that subscribe button and also click that bell so that you guys get notified for all of my brand new videos leave your love down below i always love hearing your feedback and what you guys thought of the video let me know which videos you guys are excited to see up on the channel make sure you guys check out the other videos on my channel i have a new boohoo haul if you guys want to shop some other summer clothing i'm gonna have more summer hauls coming up soon thank you guys so much for watching and i will see all of my beautiful babes in my next video